Hello my wonderful pair bears and welcome back to Gaming with Shelly. I hope you guys are having an absolutely amazing day. I know you are getting bombayed with new series all this week. But with the return of, of course, the Legacy Challenge, made new, and a new challenge called the Big Sister Challenge, I decided to return to my favourite challenge, that I started twice on my channel and then lost save files, but hey, everybody loved this challenge while I was doing it and it was very popular and it's still very popular on a lot of channels at the moment, as well as I have brought in some new subscribers because of this challenge and I just really missed recording her. So with an all new character, of course, as you see in front of you, and of course, with new packs and everything, gameplay is going to be a little bit more fun because we've got a lot of um, potential um, storylines to go with this. So with the new updates and everything, gameplay is getting a little bit more, um, let's say, spontaneous. So a lot of things happen without even mods. I do have mods, as you can tell in my gameplay, but I don't have a lot of them anymore. I did get a lot, rid of a lot of my CC, and I've literally only kept um, my CC from Clumsy Alien Collection. As you can tell in a lot of my series at the moment, that's all I really use for the clothes, because that's my kind of style, and I wanted to bring my style out in gameplay again. So for anyone who is new to my channel, and is not aware, the 100 baby challenge is of course where you have to give birth to 100 children in as few generations as possible. The challenge ends as soon as your 100th child is born, or if you fail the challenge for breaking rules. Now, we all like to story play a lot of our, our games and challenges, and I'm not wi um, wanting to win any um, special little badges for winning the 100 baby challenge or anything like this. It's just a lot of fun because you do fall in love with your characters and you just want to see all of those kids moved out and starting lives on their own. And thankfully we can do that now where once they've moved out they will have their own lives. We just have to make sure we set this uh, that family to unplayed so they can go on without us. In order to get started, you have to have a young adult sim to start out with. We call her our matriarch. And of course, guys, this is our matriarch, our beautiful girl here. This is Katrina Lamb. I randomized the name. It's not after anybody in particular. I just randomized. <clears throat> For the sake of clarity, the matriarch will be re referenced with female pronouns in the rules, but your matriarch may have any gender. Or customizations as you want as long as you can get pregnant so you can be a male a female um a he a she all of these you don't really need to follow a lot of rules in order to play this you know put yourself in the game you can be the matriarch you give birth to 100 babies in the game it's all for fun so we get to decide the traits the aspirations the appearance the walk style her voice and so on and so forth so I don't really pick her voice around and I just let that be randomized. The only thing I really do is pick out what she wears. So we're going to talk about what I give her. I normally give her this anyways. So um, it's just a little bit of my own in it. So she's a bookworm. She's romantic. Uh, she's family oriented. Um, I don't know. Prefers to be exclusively in romantic. Okay, that's fine. Uh, she has a fear of fighting. That's a new thing. And she's domesticated. I did give her some likes and dislikes. So she likes um, lullaby radio music, romance, uh, and S-pop. She also likes knitting, baking, gardening, cooking, and writing. That's everything I love. And I wanted to give her some likes so it'll be a little bit easier for her to earn some money from home. Colours, of course, I gave her are pink and purple. And decor is storybook decor and French country decor. So as we go along, we get to do the house up as we go as long as well. I picked Del Sol Valley and I pe picked this house in Del Sol Valley. I just changed the colours on the inside. And we're going to go into that there now. It's all the same furniture. I just moved everything that's on this side over here. I changed the colour of the countertops. And I changed, these were kind of like a rusty orange or something. So I just changed them to pink, pink and purple. 
Um, bathroom I didn't change anything in. I got rid of the wooden chair, which was actually more expensive than this thing here. And I changed that colour there. I gave her an easel. Um, and I kept the TV that came with the house, but I just changed the counter space. A lot of things, are, as you will see, I am cl uh, clumping them together to make it more cosy because it's going to be filled with you know kids stuff soon and we have plenty of room to build extra bedrooms and um, this is her bedroom for now where I also bought her a cross stitch um, thing and a knitting box which of course she has to put I think just this in her inventory does this go or, no she can stitch from the box that's awesome anything that she makes from knitting or cross stitch she will sell on Plopsy um, we'll save up to buy her a computer and um, so I used this storybook thing in order to give um, so we had a certain amount of starting funds which is why we could afford this and we had some money left to just buy a few little pieces Um, we are going to save up for a computer now she can have a job but it has to be a work from home job um, I think a writing job or something like that would be work from home and the aim of course is for us to have 100 babies so let's continue on with the rules a little bit I've been talking too much I'm just going to kind of let her um, do her own thing so um, you may use the in-game personality quiz in order to determine your matrix career traits skills and starting funds if you like you may also opt out of this option if you prefer I opted in for the extra starting funds we got 25,000 instead and hence the new colours and a little bit of um, I don't know where the rest of it went. I, I have no idea. Um, move your matriarch into any lot she can afford with her starting funds. You may move as many times as you want during the challenge as long as you can afford it without cheating. I want to try and stay in this house. Uh, no, we don't want to go to Batul. Thank you very much. Um, as long as you can afford it without cheating, find a sim to impregnate your matriarch for the sake of clarity. These sims will be called donors and reference with male pronouns in the rules. But your matriarch may have children with non-binary sims as well. Continue having children in the manner while following the rest of the challenge rules. Um, you can apparently there's a custom aspiration you can get from Kwai Stacy, but I know she's updating a lot of hers at the moment. We will check it out, but I think we're happy enough. I gave her the big happy family aspiration and we have to spend a thousand euro on kids stuff okay so basic rules you must play with aging on so we're going to do that right now uh, gameplay okay so uh, normal and aging is on right yeah auto aging for NPCs. NPC, uh, npcs um always right, yeah 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 okay that's fine there we go uh, we'll also try and follow a couple of her whims as well because it does help us with um, points. Any mod or CC that can give you an unfair advantage over other players are not allowed. Mods that allow you to overstuff your household or gain money through child support payments are definitely not allowed. I don't think I have them on. No cheats. The only exception to this is BB Movie Objects on. So, you know, you can fit in more clutter and stuff to make it more lived in because she's going to have a lot of kids, guys. We're going to have seven kids at a time. Although I'm thinking about making it just six kids at a time because I really want them to have a pet. And I know that's a personal choice. You don't have to. It's not actually a rule. It's a personal choice. Um, babies cannot be aged up until you get a notification say it's a birthday. Toddlers could not be aged up until they're level three in toddler skills. Children and teenagers cannot be aged up when they are in A in school. And of course have a good, um, what's the word? Um, you know, they get the manner thing here so like emotional control and stuff like that so yeah so we have got a few things to start off with of course we have to meet some potential men and move on with, um i can't believe i pressed that okay what is she doing she's practicing flirting okay okay so the aim of this of course is to be building as much skills as we can we are also going to try and find a job that we can work from home with. But yeah, um, let's see now. Okay, I also have the slice of my life mod in, so she will have a menstrual cycle. Um, okay, so it has to be ones where she can work from home. Uh, okay, business. 
education, can she work from home with that? Engineer, like freelance, she can work from home, but I'm not really into the freelancing at the moment. Uh, let's see, um, a salary person, can they work from home? Um, how about social media career? We could do the social media career. I think we can do that from home. Um, we just update our social media status. Okay. All right, okay, so create a social media. Okay. Um, do we need a computer to do that? Oh, we need a computer. Okay, well, you know what? We can go out and... Oh, she's viewing her easel. We can go out and about in the world as well. Uh, we can go to a library and find, you know, do our first work activity. Um, oh, what did I do? Okay, I did it again. <laughs> um, so we're gonna go out into the world, find a library and create a work, um, a social media account. What's this, this is a museum. And then what we can do is um, meet a few potential donors while we're out and about. That's the best thing I can say. Let's, um, make a social media account okay there we go and while we're there we can meet some potentials Salma okay so Salma's obviously um, not available <laughs> for us uh, but I think she can make some friends right um, okay we have her doing her first work activity and then we can just scour the world on the road. Okay, there we go. Katrina has, all right, okay, she's created it. Okay, so we're just gonna wander around and try and find some male victims. Okay, who are you? Oh, no, Dennis Kim, no, thank you. <laughs> uh. Little girl. Gyms are a good place to meet people. That's a nice big pond. I can just get her to go and scavenge from some stuff as well while we're looking. Um, frogs. Ooh, pear trees. Okay. Um, I would like her to do a little bit of gardening as well while we're looking. For potential males. Um, I'd like for her to have a little garden as well as um, while pregnant she can be doing all of these like knitting and things like that. Are you a kid? You are a child. That's Max Villarreal. Oh yeah I remember we actually used Jacques before as one of our um, potential uh, one of our donors. I actually don't want to use him this time because last time he died on us. But I do want us to meet some people. Mm -hmm. Lily Fang. Uh, Alright, are you... Okay, you're an elder as well, but so even if you are male, uh, I wouldn't be ready. <laughs> I just wouldn't be able to... Okay, so when the pear tree blooms, I will be coming back because I want pear trees in my game. For, of course, for every single one of my beautiful pear bears that watch. Okay, so while she's gathering... Oh, 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 Dominic Fries. Okay, let's go and meet him. Um, okay, I know he's married. Uh, but we're not looking for like to break up a family. We're just looking for some Help if that's the best way I can say that then that's the way I'll say it um, We're we're getting a lot of stuff Oh, what's that? An apple tree as well. Wow, this place is great for pear and apple trees um, Getting lots of frogs awesome we will be going over to speak to Dominic very soon. There I am. Uh, yeah, that's all. <laughs> uh, 
Um, hopefully we can um, at least have pregnant with our first heir by the end of this. Ooh, snapdragon flower. They make us a lot of money, so having a few snapdragons, that's definitely the way to go. Um, yeah, we lost Dominic. Dominic is gone. Okay. Um, there has to be... It's a kid. Okay, Faris. Who's this? Baco. Okay, we found Baco. Let's go and have a respectful introduction to Baco. This is Miriam Melton. Ooh, okay. Uh, we've got a few over here. We've got an Ahmed Fox. Make sure we have a nice introduction to him too. And of course, Bjorn Bergensen, of course. Tainik at that. He's got eyes really cute. Is this? Ooh, Marcus Flax. Oh, I remember him from the first time I did the 100 Baby Challenge. He was really hard. Alright, is he leaving? Is that why I can't click on him? Yes, that's more than likely it. Okay, so we got a few good bits. Wow, we did get a few good bits. Okay. Um, who are you? Okay, Nina Caliente. No. Thank you. Uh, Dominic is leaving. Dominic is sad. Girl, can you catch up with these people before they disappear? Um, did we get to know Baco? I think we got to know Baco. Okay, the other dude is gone. Okay. Um, Alan Melton. Okay, well... Freeze, dude. Why are they all running? Uh, or right, respectful introduction. Okay. What do you mean we have no? I've had her saying hello to everybody. Like, what's going on here? Julia. Alright, Victor Vang. Okay. Why can't we say hi to him? He's in the... Oh, wow. Okay. All right, we've got two people we can start kind of becoming friends with, I suppose. So let's build up this friendship a little bit. Why is she asking for reassurance? The act of gross behavior? Who's gross? Okay. Um... I could not imagine life without you now. Do you feel the same way? That's very... Uh, nope. That's a very weird question to be asking somebody that we just met. Um, okay, so I'm just going to have her uh, do a bit of cooking. Um, ooh, bread. That's actually pretty cool. Uh, Alright, okay, sorry. We have to go to the fridge if we want or to do like stuff like fruit salad and things. Um just gonna kinda have her get her cooking skill up there with a fruit salad. Okay, girl, just go to the bathroom. Okay. So we are gonna kinda get her to start um her knitting skill as well. Um I think this helps with fun if she if it's a preference that she likes. Uh, girl, get back there and cook. Why does this happen? Okay, so let's invite over Alan. I know you're right, I don't care. Uh, okay, so while we're waiting for her to do all of this, um, the aim in long term is to turn this into like a kitchenette area slash family um, eating area. And then, like, um, stuff like when we build on an extra room and things like that. And um, we'd have, like, toddler beds, baby beds, stuff like that. It's a big lot. I know it left her with not a lot of money. But, um, right, we're going to have auto lights on every room to help with the ESB. 
All right, he'll be right over. Awesome. Okay, here he is. Okay, so first off, we need to build our relationship with him because she's making garden salad. The two of them can have it. Um, she is hungry, so it's definitely ooh, it's excellent quality. Oh, he likes her. He likes her decor. So ask about day. Um. Okay. Okay, he's having full conversation with her. That's what I like. Um. Just because his bored mood and stuff like that. Sure. Um, we need to get to know more about him as well. We can't just jump straight in there with um, uh, brightening his day. Get to know. Uh, do we have that option yet? There we go. Get to know. What is wrong with this dude? Check on him, see is he okay? Uh, okay, it's not really... None of the options, like, it's like, it kind of keeps glitching out. This is mine coming to watch our TV though. Um, ask him about his career. Oh, okay, okay. She's in a playful mood. He's still bored. Um, he's a stay-at-home dad. Okay. Ask for taste and decor. So this is how we get to know a lot of people as well when you find out what their interests and are. Um. Okay, how many are three days? Oh god, no. <laughs> okay. Uh, I like suburban contempo decor. Oh, yeah, as for his taste in music, he's non committal. Okay. It's a bit of a weird scenario, seen as you know. Let's try. Let's do a flirtatious joke and see if he takes it. Oh, he likes classical music. Oh, I should have got her a little music player. Ooh. Wait, what? How is he so flirty so quickly? Um, confess your attraction because he's flirty. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, make a move. I can't believe he's flirty already. Ooh, will it be because I put on the house romantic aura? <laughs> oh my god, this is so freaking cute. She's very flirty. Oh my god, she's so tiny compared to him. I give her, I have like the size, um, sliders so I can make her teeny. <laughs> I'm at her teeny. Oh, Girl, you ain't tired yet. Soup. We are soup. putting the moves on Alan Mil Milton. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> um, oh, first kiss already, guys. Oh my god, this is so freaking cute. Or right, we'll definitely, definitely have our first baby. This is so cute. I like this glass thing. Oh my god. Yes, okay. Um, I kind of want them to take a picture together. Because this is literally going to be the first daddy. <laughs> um, chat with Alan. Okay. This is so freaking cool. Like, So what, putting romantic aura on it is exactly how we're going to do this. <gasps> it's Oh yes, that's awesome. Okay. Oh, he is red-haired. We kind of 
kind of greeny, oceany, bluey eyes. I like that. Okay, I'm gonna. No, I actually. Okay. <laughs> Why oh, is this so bad? I actually, I know I take too many pictures. Here we go. Uh, right, okay. Their friendship is building. Well, their relationship is building. Um, okay, let's, um. Girl, don't even think bad. Okay. Um, can we? Oh, yes, we can. Yes, we can. Oh my god, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. If they are preggers. After this, I'm going to have her do um, a painting and obviously put her to bed. And we can, you know, like knit some onesies and make some cross stitches and make money from that. And of course, our job. Oh, wow, he's got really, really red hair. That is freaking awesome. Oh, God. Um, I'm sorry because he's a stay at home dad as well. So he's already got kids. Um, and we're gonna take a pregnancy test. That was great, but I think it's time for me to go home. See you later. Oh, seriously, dude. Okay, let's see. Here it is. Here it is. Are we? Are we? Are we? Yes! Woo! Okay, we are officially pregnant with the first baby. This is so cool, my little one. Okay. No, alright, no, 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 no. Just go to sleep, girl. Just go to sleep. Okay, so it's morning. Work popped up and I said she's going to work from home. So she has to level up Christmas skill. And she has to watch funny videos on Sims TV. We need a computer for that. Uh, we did get some stuff yesterday. So let's see if we can... Uh make some dough okay so it says I'll um all of these it's 230 smolians okay okay the cheapest computer is 800 um it's gonna help us a little better if we're working from home if we have a computer so yeah it's gonna be 800 macaroonies that we need okay there we go. So she has. Good girl, can you please eat your garden salad? Ooh, we're already showing. And then we're gonna have her do some stuff. Career. Um, how do we watch Sim TV? There we go. Uh, nope. We can't afford college right now. We are expecting our first baby. Okay. So we have fifty simoleons. Um, we're going to have to use the mirror in the bathroom to raise our charisma skill. Uh, we need to save up a thousand simoleons for us to spend on kids stuff, which actually means making a kid's bedroom. Uh, which we can do. I know we can do. Um, we could give up her bedroom for now and um, put her bed out here so it's kind of like a loft situation or a bed sit. Uh, okay girl, you really need to stop doing that. Okay, cool. Um, I hate the fact that we're going to need a, a vacuum cleaner soon because of the fact that... Um, oh, morning sickness girl, I'm sorry. Um, okay, so she has to... Girl... Alright, okay. You lay, level that up, but then you seriously are going to have to watch this for two hours. So welcome again. Ooh. Oh, oh, I love Vanessa Jean. I love her, actually. She is really friendly. Okay. Hilarious videos. Okay. You have to watch it though for two hours. Are you watching it? Okay. Alright, let's cancel the welcome wagon. Because we can actually... Okay, keep watching them for an hour please, at a time. 
it doesn't matter how many times you have to watch it just to get that done and then we're going to go back into the bathroom and do our Christmas skill oh she really has got a bathroom as well hey Katrina I've been thinking about uh, getting to know Bajorn Burgenson a little better do you think the two of us should hang out sometime <sighs> um yeah okay that's actually up to you it's really not up to her Okay, we've got the first part of our work yoke done. Come on, girl. Yay! Okay. We got 47 simoleons for that. We need to level up our charisma skill. Girl, you need to go to the bathroom. Alright, just go to the toilet. Um, and then you just level up your charisma, my deal. Okay. So she's going to level up her charisma, and that's work duties done. Um... Best with improved career performance are going to work with um, completing the daily tasks. Okay. Alright, we got paid for doing our tasks. Okay, so. You need to go take yourself a bath. Alright, okay. And we have enough now to do a, a painting. We're going to start doing small ones because they're 50 simoleons each. We need to start bringing in some cash. Oh, we can write. Forget that. For now, we're just going to write. Uh, write a genre book. A genre, a genre book. Okay, so she's going to start writing and her, letting her have her little bubble bath. Um, we do need to go and explore. But we can explore our surroundings. Because sometimes... I was actually going to be so happy the kids could play in the park over here. Uh, yeah, we'll just leave it at that for now. Or we just have her where she just started writing books. Um, for a little bit of cash. Ooh, we got some daisies. Let's harvest the daisies as well. Um, did I click this? I did. Uh, ooh, we got another rock over here. We can't rummage yet. But look, we actually have a play area for our kids. How cool is that? Ooh, we got some lemon trees more daisies um okay once she's finished writing the story we can self-publish Ooh, we're level two writing already um focus from being a judger eating for two i can't believe this oh we have to apply some lotion as well i think um pregnancy is going to play a bit of a number on her uh, wow, okay. We can publish it by clicking on the mailbox. Self-publish. Never eat your pet turtle and other advice for kindergartners. <laughs> wow, okay, girl. You're so cool. Um, okay. So, like, we've got lots of lemon trees around our house. So we can definitely start a like a little garden over here. Um, oh, we have some daisies. One, two, three, four. I'm going to plant all the daisies I just collected. Okay. Um, okay, girl, you need to go to the bathroom before you actually explode. Okay, so we're going to move you down here. Okay, it's, uh, oh wow, really, okay, she really needs to be in bed, oh, it's like you forget when you're getting stuff done that you actually have to, okay, she published her book, um, yeah, okay, I need her to eat as well, and then we'll just let her go to bed, it's rising shine time, my girl. It's rising time. Yeah, you heard me. All right, I'm going to have her planting these as well while we're here. Um, I plant the lemon trees at the front of the house. Just more so we can um, have more like privacy for when we do start having the children. Um, it's like, what's nicer than having like your own lemon trees in the front of your house okay uh, 
I wonder what we're going to have. Um, okay, so while she's actually pregnant, we're going to keep on like making money. All right, I want to sell. Oh, we can't do that. Okay. Sell. Sell the rest of these. Um, oh, that's 160. Okay. And I want her to list things on Plopsy. Okay. Oh, um, she's going to work from home. Oh, we got promoted to Engagement Monkey. Okay, we got 141 simoleons, a check-in at a venue. Um, awesome. All right, okay, what's our daily tasks from home? Level up your writing skill. We need 25 followers. Yeah, she could do that right now. Actually, yeah, we could. Um... Add your Instagram story. Ooh, we got some earbuds. We got some earbuds. I can fix the layout of this when it's done. Um, do a mischief on five different sims. Oh, frick. I don't like doing mischief stuff. Add to your sim. All right, you've got 12 followers. And I think if we were to update our status, we would get some more. <gasps> 27 followers yes girl yes girl okay level up our writing skill okay well because we were going to write another story anyways um let's do another children's book and when that's done oh she's very pregnant <laughs> all right let's plant our lemon trees in the front of our house as well um okay now we just wrote that book let's um preparing for motherhood. There I go. I'm just going to say it's a children's. Uh, uh, this is a read with caution. <laughs> oh my god, yeah, this is a read with caution story. There we go. Um, okay. Geek Con's in town. We're not going to Geek Con. We will be writing and planting. Oh, did we get some money from our book? Oh, we got seven simoleons for our book. Okay, Alan Milton. Okay. Um. Right, okay. Some of our work stuff, I don't know how we're going to do it. We have to level up our writing skill, which we're doing now by writing. We have till 3pm to do a, And we need to invite over... Oh, alright, okay. Do you know what? Actually, stop, 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 stop. Um, it doesn't actually say we have to know the Sims. All right, so let's do respectful introductions. And then what we can do then is we can do a mischief interaction on people that pass our street. Which at the moment is just Caleb. It was Caleb, right? Caleb Fator? Yeah. Okay. Now, last time I was doing, like, um, do you know, occult, sim occult sims as well. Um, if I can help it, we won't be doing occult sims this time. Um, but if it happens, it happens. If it doesn't, it doesn't. I'll still count it as one child instead of two. Just because, um, I don't know. All right, Caleb likes us, so we do mischief action on him. Uh, lie about bad plasma. Okay. Okay. So if you do it on five different sims, right? Right, okay. Oh, he's not happy. Uh, mischief. Let's do a... Lie about your career, I suppose. We're in engagement. I want to see if that counts as a second one here. No. Still one. Uh, yep. Yeah, it doesn't really count. Okay. Alright, while she's doing that, let's invite over him, her, him. That's all we know actually at the moment. That's actually really weird. I'm not going to make her go around and pause. Who are you? 
Selena Fox. Hi, Selena. Um, how are you doing? And I'll, but I have to go now. Okay, bye. Um, Alan's on his way. Vanessa's on her way. Awesome. Okay, you will be the first for a mischievous interaction asking what's that. Uh, second is Vanessa, who's probably going to like it because she just seems like, why do we have to attempt an introduction to her? Okay, here we go. They're already in our house. Uh, Bajorn, my dear, you need a mischievous interaction as well. What's that spot? Where are you going? Girl, stop. Oh. I need you to do mischievous interactions. It's for work. Not that I want you to do them, but like it's for work. For some reason, you have to do five interactions. Uh, time to introduction. Uh, dude, off my computer. It's not for you, eh? For everyone but Butler. I think, like, you know, she could be our best friend. She could become our best friend. I hope so, anyways. Alright, we're on our third one, is it? Okay, no. That was the second one. Um, scare. Third one? Yes, okay, that was our third one. He's our four, and then we just need to meet one more person to do that. Okay, should we, what's this about? With people. Oh, okay. Um, she really needs to go to the bathroom. Did you not do... Did it not... Did he not count as four? Mischief. Scare. Is he come? Oh, he's... This is really fun, but I really have to go. Okay. Do we not do a scare tactic on Bajoran? Okay, I'm just going to make her use this because she is going to freaking die if she doesn't do it. Oh my god. Um, It's so near tree. Oh, but Jordan doesn't like us. Okay, okay. Where are you gone? Oh my god, please come back. Fine, okay. Did it not work on somebody? Did it not work on you? Um, what's that spot? Okay. Okay, I'm gonna get her to cook as well because she does have people over, and um, she can give them some treats. Did it work? <laughs> no. Oh, freaking heck. Oh, we're not going to get paid. Okay, go. <clears throat> okay, so if she's working from home, then like it just means that she has not a lot of time. Oh, he's doing our lemons. Oh, oh, oh. <coughs> uh, we've got a few people coming. Go, 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 go. Everyone's coming into our house. Is it because we're... Okay, we might get this done. Oh, we're in our second trimester. Whoa, that was fast. Uh, okay, mischief, scare. Alright, okay, she's saying hi. Did it work? Is it number four? Yay! Okay. Um. Yay! Okay, let's do, do our last mission of interaction with her. Oh wow, okay. I might try. It's getting like extremely dry. Uh, chat All right, okay, no. Seriously, mischief and scare her. Yay, okay, we did that, we did that, we did that. 
Okay. Alright, I need to get her back on and writing. Resume your writing. Okay, all we gotta do is level up our writing skill. Um, I have to go over to see you. Okay, cool, bye. Um, actually, we can get, we can also create a club. Um, okay, I need to just put in Bajorn, Caleb, Mortimer, um, Elika, and Victor. That's all we can put in there right now. Uh, I'm just going to say future dads. Okay. Let's do the bear. Okay. And no, it's invite only. Um, they. Right. No. There's no requirements. Okay. There we go. Okay. Did we do it? Girl, you didn't even finish your writing, so I don't know why you did that to me. So that is Pierce Stilgasho. That is Nancy Landgrab. Um, we are on the last bit of our work, and then we're going to send them all home. Um, I have to go get going now. See you later. Bye, Nancy. Okay, Mr. Pierce, you need to go too. Bye-bye. Okay, you finish your writing, please, for me. Yay, okay. We are done with all of our tasks for work. So I'm going to get her to go and do a, a painting. Um, okay, so we've got 500 points more. We need another... Ooh, Agnes. I've called to inform you that your great great grand second once removed cousin's friend's grandpa has passed away and for some reason has left a vast fortune especially to you. Will you accept? Money, 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 give me now. Under what conditions? And no thanks. Uh, what are the conditions? Ooh, we just got two and a half grand. Awesome. It feels cheaty, but um, I answered a question. I got, I got money for it. So... Yay, okay, let's just do a little bit of a makeover. Right, okay, I didn't do much, uh, but I moved the desk and that out here because it's going to be kind of like the hobbies area. And then um, I let space in her room for a crib because you get free ones if you don't have one. So that's all I'm doing. And I bought the bin and this because it does showers and baths and that's exactly what we need. Um, so yeah, okay, what are we into now? Okay, third trimester is in five hours. Um, have you completed your book? Because we need you to complete the book. Okay, before bed. Ooh, because she's very focused, we're going to have her do a diagram. And off to bed for her. Um, did we water these? Everything needs to... Oh, well, we've rained. We don't need to water anything now. Ooh, look, the daisies are coming up. That's awesome. Um, okay, she finished it. She got a logical, a logic skill. Um, well, that's really, really cute because she's so focused. Um, okay, we can publish a new book. Uh, Katrina's relishing every brush stroke. Should she let the colors flow and embrace that she likes? It? Okay, yeah, of course, if she likes it. Um, oh wow. Um, we are going to keep, uh, the ones that she gets from certain feelings, because it does help. Um, okay, I do really need her to go to sleep though. Um, I'm going to get her to apply some lotion. Alright, she's in her third trimester now, so she really needs to go to sleep after all of this, so. It's very pretty, guys. Look at that. It's like a glass. Wow. Oh, wow. I like that. Okay, let's pop that in here. Okay. So when she wants to be focused, 
or actually we should leave the focus out in the hobby room is in the bedroom okay so she is going to sleep and then we're gonna her girl has woken up very focused i bought a vacuum cleaner because the house went very very dusty so i thought it'd be better see how she's doing emotionally mindful from being uh final emotional control is a journey you've taken the first steps but uh, to gain true emotional control requires more slow time through various thoughtful activities right, okay she's browsing the web have you worked today you do have work today um let's keep on building your uh you know your social account okay uh, I'd love her to become inspired so we can do an inspired painting. Uh, stitch from a pattern. Simple. Let's do a small hoop. Um, rainbow. Okay, she's 39. Okay, there we go. She's going to start cross stitching now. I would like to get her like a little comfortable chair where she could do her sewing and her knitting from. It's uh, kind of a me thing as well. That about okay. Um, okay, so she could give birth anytime. I'm thinking it's gonna be Thursday before she gives birth because you know, it's just the way things are with her. I think. Are we any upgrade parts? We've no upgrade parts yet, but we could upgrade all of our stuff. Mm, get her to take a no, not, not a steamy shower, she's already steamy enough. Uh, a thoughtful shower. Yeah, okay. And we need to water. I oh, know everything got watered in the rain yesterday. Ooh, these need to be done. Okay, there we go. Um, ooh, I can't wait to see what her cross stitch is going to be like. I love stuff like this. <gasps> oh, we got promoted to clickbait writer. Um, we are still going to be working from home. We have to respond to mail. Okay, so career, no. Um, right, no. How do we do this? Web, respond to mail. And also social networking. Let's update our social media status. Twice. There we go. Right, okay. Um, have... 100 followers which we're close to reach level 3 comedy or mischief skill um okay okay so how do we do that Ooh, got some royalties okay so we get 100 followers okay we are on Level 2 Mischief. Right, okay. How is our stats coming? 89. Okay. Uh, you are painting. Okay. Um, we're already level 2 of Mischief. So... Is there a way for us to do Mischief skill? We can write jokes on a computer for comedy. Let's do that. Let's do jokes. A girl, no, I want you to finish that. Um, don't waste money. <laughs> um, okay, so, okay. Fine, and then we can do another kind of like update in um, our, you know, our bump. Say our baby bump. Okay, right. Okay, I think we are. We will actually have our first baby at the end of this episode. As I've told you in um, the Big Sister Challenge and Legacy, I will be doing longer episodes each time, just so we can fit in a lot of fun. Girl, you need to apply some more lotion. Okay, our level two comedy, awesome. Alright, okay, I need her to eat soon though as well. It doesn't seem like she's eating anything. 
Uh, let's do a grilled cheese because who does not like grilled cheese? I know I like grilled cheese. Uh, let's have a look at her. She's still writing jokes. What level are we on? Uh, nearly level three. Okay, so we should have finished our cross stitch as well. Let's have a look in our inventory for that. Oh, wow, this is really pretty. Oh, I like that. I really like that. Is there anywhere else we can put that? Oh, all right, okay, there. Our first cross stitch. Oh, yay, we're level three. Okay, you can stop writing jokes now. Uh, yay, we've got 109 followers. Um, let's pop this owl picture of um, our first baby's daddy. Let's upload this to Instagram. We're going to add a frame. There we go. 129, 141. Okay. Have we completed our work tasks? Yes, we have. We've completed our work tasks. Um, we are now a social. Uh, if your whole job is to write articles, that uh, right? Okay. Okay. Cool. Um, social media. Uh, share an image. Ooh, love Lauren. Okay. Um, let's just hot pause and let's invite over. Let's invite over Victor. Uh, because we need to be working on our second potential daddy. Um, hey, are you a teen? Please. Boy. You are a teen. Okay, we'll give you a little time. <laughs> uh, okay. All right, I do still want her to finish her figure painting. Um, okay, so we're 166 followers. Uh, Victor will be right over. Let's pause. He's probably already, yes, he is here. Um, let's invite him in. Okay. All right, so uh, I love Del Sol Valley, actually, because we've got some very wide range of characters. Okay, so let's actually get to know him a little before we go in for the flirts, okay? Um... Actually, let's add him to our group so he doesn't try to leave. Yeah, okay. Um, actions. Open love life. Okay, okay, okay. Form a group. Add him. Awesome. Ooh, level 3 charisma. Okay. Uh, right, let's go in for a flirt. Let's see how he gets on. Because she's like third trimester pregnant, I don't think he'll go for it. <gasps> oh, 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 yay. Yes, okay. Let's uh, go here together. That's crazy. Just come inside. Victor, come inside. Why do you think, why do you just take a picture of her? That's so freaking weird. Why is he embarrassed now? <laughs> Yay! Okay. It definitely has to do with the romantic aura. That much, I'm telling you. Um, he's very focused as well, which is really, really cool. Um, offer him a rose. Oh, no, okay. Um, okay, it's fine, it's fine. Um, can we do smooth recovery? Okay, let's just kind of um, sit together. Uh, okay, so... Um, Ask about your day. Ask about his love life. <clears throat> okay. Do you think I am attractive? 
hipster. Hmm. No, I don't actually. Oh, you're rude. You're mean. Don't tell a pregnant woman she's not attractive. That's just mean. Who does that, guys? Seriously, who does that? Um. Make a move, girl. Make a move. Why is she not chatting to him anymore? Is she upset? Make a blind. I was going to talk like if they were in my house to get the whole flirty feeling. Or maybe he just really loves his wife. Oh, he is flirty now. Okay, okay, let's try this again. Um, flirt. If he goes for the flirt, then we'll continue. Uh, block it. Who took it? Okay. He's gonna leave soon. I'll bring my rose. He's not flirty anymore. Oh, he's flirty now. Can we make a move on him? Ooh, first kiss. I think we got our second potential daddy. <laughs> Yay! He just kisses her forehead because she's so small. But her bump is humongous. Okay. Um. Why is he so embarrassed? Okay, we can plant him in with. Uh, what can we do? Alright, um. <laughs> Woohoo's is the best <laughs> option. <gasps> oh, girl, girl, girl. Oh, yes, guys. Oh my god, this is so freaking cool. Um. Girl, go have the baby at the hospital. You're gonna go alone. Okay, let's go. Okay, go. Oh my god, yes. That's okay, I need to pick like, baby names. Baby names. <laughs> Oh, we had a boy. Oh, we had a boy. Okay. Um, I really like the name Andrew. Uh, let's have a look. Okay, so he is. All right, we have Liam, James, Ethan, Henry. Um, Noah. Oh, Noah. All right, okay, Noah. Name is Noah. Oh, God, we have our first little baby. Well, guys, welcome, Noah Lamb. What? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, we have a girl as well. Okay, Frick. Um, Frick. Or right, okay, because I've been watching Jane Austen an awful lot lately, um, our first girl's name is going to be called, okay, I thought it was typing, it's not, uh, Jane. So, everybody, meet Noah and Jane Lamb. Okay. We had twins. Frick. <laughs> frick, frick, frick. We had twins. <coughs> that is insane. Um... Wow, okay. Okay, so we've had Noah and Jean. Okay, our first set of babies. Uh, didn't get birth certificates because obviously we didn't go to the hospital with her, but um, it's fine. Um, dag dag, don't you freaking dare. Don't dag dag. You come back here. Don't dag dag. A victor. Victor, Victor, don't, Victor. Get your butt back here. Seriously, Dag Dag might be gone. He's gone. Okay. Well, maybe it's best. Maybe it's for the best. We have had our first set of twins. Hopefully, not our only set of twins in this wonderful challenge once in Heart Bed. 
But yeah, we have, of course, got our little Noah and our little Jane. In the next episode, we, of course, will be getting impregnated again by Victor. And, of course, aging up these two beauts. Yeah, in two days' time, before another baby comes, or set of babies. But yeah, guys, I hope you are enjoying the new 100 Baby Challenge. And I hope um, it's is as much fun as it was when I first recorded it and if you guys want to see more episodes like this make sure you hit that subscribe button so you're told every time I upload a new video and I shall see you guys all in another video. Bye!